So I would like to introduce you into the smart barcode verification module of the TubeScan 100% inspection system. So our task today is to inspect this variable data within this data matrix code. For that, the TubeScan has the opportunity to activate the optional barcode module, which you find here. This is one of the optional modules which you have beside the Delta E monitoring, the PDF comparison, or the distance monitoring, or the decoding of alphanumeric codes. So in this job now, we will concentrate on the barcode verification. I activate the barcode verification, and you can see that we already selected some barcodes. If you would like to add a new position, you simply push the plus button and you can select a barcode. In order to erase maybe a position which you do not like, you just put it away. Now coming more into details, if we go to this first barcode, we can see immediately the content of this barcode and we can tell the system if it should simply decode this code or if we do additional analysis and give also a grading result. In this case, we selected only the decoding, which means we will make sure that the code is readable and correctly printed without giving additional information about the grading quality. Beside that, we can also inform the system if we have a static code or if we have a variable code with, for example, incremental sequence. So in this case, we will select incremental and so the system will automatically check if the code is really increasing in its figures. So we are done. Now we can activate the system by switching on the defect detection mode because we should not forget in the background we will perform 100% print defect detection and the barcode is an add-on. You see immediately a window popping up showing the content of the data matrix and as soon as I will start the machine, so I will start the machine, you will get the result of the inspection on the main screen. We will show you the content of the codes, we will show you the grading result and we will bring these results onto display. So that's how the TubeScan makes a very simple, reliable 100% inline backward control. Thanks for your attention. Bye. I would like to introduce you into the TubeScan 100% inspection system and the simplicity of use of the system. The only thing that TubeScan needs to be ready for inspecting your material is the repeat lengths. So we indicate the repeat lengths of your job and we take a reference image in order to be able to compare 100% of your production with this reference image. In order to run the system, we activate the defect detection mode. Now the system is ready to do 100% inspection of your web. We start the machine. And as soon as the system finds a defect, you will see it on the main screen, like here. We will show it on the operator interface and show the placement queue. And we will stop the machine at the location which was predefined by the operator so that the operator can remove the defect label. That's how easy it is to adjust the tube scan and to make it run on the GM machine.